Hey guys, welcome once again to One Coin Only. And always get started, we just want to announce a One Coin Only shop. If you want to grab yourselves a hoodie or a tee, uh, grab yourself one. The money we do make supports the brand, so thank you for your support. And how you go, guys? Once again, this is One Coin Only here, and uh, we're going to be playing some fun games today. Once again, well, we have been playing some fun games. We're going to finish off here with a, a YouTube today. And uh, we're going to be playing Mega Man, the Atari D-Make. I've only ever streamed this once. Uh, this was on Xbox Gaming before. Uh, kind of as a bonus game over there too, actually. And uh, this is a really nice version of Mega Man 2. It kind of looks at things from a different perspective. And uh, it's kind of more of a gimmick game, but I definitely wanted to have a copy of the stream on YouTube. So we're going to see how it plays out today. And, uh, yeah, we'll take it from there. How are you going, Rob? It's good to see you again once again. And uh, how's your day going, my friend? RMV in the place to be. <laughs> we'll play out the intro. Just give me my chance to have a little bit of coffee while some people come in. Coffee's the only way I'm going to stay awake today, seriously. Feeling so flat for some reason. And uh, what's going on, my man? Oh, gosh. This is really, really nice. It's not bad for instant cappuccino. I don't have a coffee maker. There we go. So the Atari remix of Mega Man. Let's do this. Oh, there it is. It's not been too bad. Good to hear, sir. I'm gonna open a new file here. Ah, yes. The American Waters, right? <laughs> oh, who do we normally start with? We normally start with Metal Man, don't we? Let's see how we go here. This plays a little bit different to the NES version. But, uh, yeah, still pretty similar. Let's see how we go. You can see, it's gonna throw everyone off at first. Alright. I like how ambitious the idea behind this game was, actually. Now, I have played through this whole thing once before, and they really did pull it off. I like, um, you've got option of, like, the Atari music or regular music. Um, I just picked the regular music with the Atari sound effects. I feel like the Atari music as well gets a little bit repetitive after a while. So I've kept the regular soundtrack here. I didn't want to bleed your ears, you know what I mean? <laughs> oh, crap. There's no... Ah, oh, shit! There's no save states in this either. Son of a bitch! I'm gonna st start this level again. Oh, I'm going to start again. Hopefully I get my lives back. It's almost like an Atari port. Yeah, that's all. This is actually a PC game that was made to look like the Atari port. So, uh... Please tell me I got my lives back now that I've done that. Yeah, I do. Cool. That's really frustrating. I'm just going to get used to the mechanics again. We'll be okay. <laughs> oh, jeez. Let's see how we go here. No save stage, yeah. But I'm usually pretty good at Mega Man, uh... Too, so it shouldn't be an issue, but it's really annoying if you make a silly mistake to go all the way back to the beginning, you know? That kind of sucks. But, uh, we'll make do. We'll be fine. We got this today. I think the bosses are a little bit harder in this one, too. There we go. I don't care if I take the hit. I just didn't want to fall down that damn hole, you know what I mean? <laughs> oh, gosh. At least more people enter soon. I don't know if they got the notification or not. Sometimes it takes a little while. Um, now yeah, it feels pretty similar to the NES version. It's a little, oh, it's, it's it's close. Uh, it, actually, you know what? Uh, this handles more like Mega Man 1. It's not quite as refined as the second game. It kind of feels like the first game. Uh, which is still not bad. I know how to play the first game pretty well, so it's not a big deal. Uh, but yeah, not quite as perfect as the second game. I don't know if that makes sense. I don't know if you've played Mega Man 1 before. Oh, you got your notification from Twitter? Oh, yeah, I don't know. Sometimes people get them, sometimes they don't. Maybe YouTube thinks I'm spamming people with all the streams we're doing lately, I don't know. <laughs> I 
I had a lot of people tell me they're not getting them. It's alright. Should have a few people rock up. I told him I'd be here. Hopefully. If not, it's you and me, brother. This monster's a little bit different. Ah, damn it. Oh, here we go. We're almost there. Boom. I don't know if this is going to be enough help to beat the boss, because he's actually pretty tricky from memory in this version, but uh, a lot of dodging required. Okay, no, we got this. Be careful, I guess. See, you see what I mean? The, the biggest issue is not only just moving platforms, it's the fact that these shots don't seem to be taking a lot of a lot of help off him, so it's, it's actually quite tough. And every time he hits me, it's like, jeez, man. <laughs> ah! Should definitely get him the next time round. Oh gosh, come on. Ah, come on. Oh, we almost got him. It's okay. Freaking out a little bit here, though. I don't want to have to do this again, really. Oh! Jeez, that was close. Far out, man. Will you die already, Metal Man, you sumbish? Ah! Oh, gosh. Man, that's only the first robot boss. Oh, what's on the TV tonight, Rob? Oh my gosh. That was a hectic boss battle. We can't deny this version of Mega Man's exciting. <laughs> oh, I'm going to do Woodman first, I think. Uh, is that Woodman? Yeah. And then I'm going to go do Airman, and then I can do... Oh, hang on. Woodman, Airman, Bubble Man, then Heat Man. Okay, I've got a plan of attack here. I think we got this. This is probably one of my favourite themes. I love the Woodman theme. And give me a sec, guys. I'm just going to give a little bit more volume here. There we go. I just make it a little bit more comfortable. Terminator 1 for the 18th time. You know, I could watch Terminator on repeat if I'm going to be totally honest. You know, I have to admit, after 18 times, Rob, that would probably get annoying. But I love the Terminator franchise. Well, at least the first two, anyway. Number three wasn't bad. Number four, I'll probably only want watching the Blue Moon. Uh, the only Terminator I was really disappointed in, to be honest, was Genesis. I get why they wrote the story they did for Genesis, but uh, yeah, the execution just didn't work for me. Hopefully they, hopefully they redeem themselves. I think Terminator should just be rebooted now. Well, Genesis was kind of a reboot, but I mean they should reboot it properly. That was a failed reboot. Yeah. But I appreciate it. You're basically saying that you prefer to watch one of my streams than Terminators. That's a really big deal. I'm only playing. <laughs> and how you going, Headlocked? It's good to see you, Dwayne. Thanks for entering the room. Sorry, man. Just saw your comment there. And uh, thank you for a kick-ass stream earlier today, my friend. It was absolutely awesome. You absolutely... Man, you were the king of Mortal Kombat. I don't know what else to say. You just, you just annihilated that freaking game, man. Seriously. Oh, the second one was so far ahead of its time. I think I was only 9 or 10 years old when I saw the second Terminator. I think I was in the 5th grade. And, uh... So I was probably 10. And, uh... Man, that... That, that movie still really holds up well with, with, with the, the CGI and everything. That was just absolutely stunning. I think, I think James Cameron, Cameron is an absolute genius, actually. Oh, that was so good. There we go, we're almost out of here, I think. Headlock kicked the shit out of Mortal Kombat. I tell you, I can't wait for part two tomorrow. I, th I think the story mode for uh, Mortal Kombat uh, Complete Edition is one of the most epic ones ever. Alright. Uh, I think oh, we're not quite there yet. 
If you didn't blink, you would honestly believe that this was an Atari game, wouldn't you? This is just so well done. I know it's kind of a gimmick, it's not something that I'm going to pull out and play all the time, but I really, really appreciate this for what it is. I think it's great. There we go, we got it. How you doing, George? It's really good to see you today. Thanks for coming in. Welcome once again to One Point Only, sir, for our bonus exclusive YouTube stream. Just to make it a little bit more fancy. <laughs> Make it sound a bit more fancy than what it is, but we appreciate you coming in. And, uh, how is your evening going, sir? Alright. Oh, you can't hit them. They're made out of metal. I see how it is. Alright, let's go. The jumpy, jumpy bish. Alright, no, we'll just keep going here. It's a shooty shooty bish. I'll just jump over. Ah, oh, crap. Let's see how we go. I think Woodman usually. I think Metal Blade usually works pretty good against Woodman. We'll see. Okay. Pretty much the same pattern as the NES version, so no sweat, hopefully. Feel like maybe it's a little bit tricky again. I gotta try and get on this other side. Come on, we can do this. Just a couple more hits. Don't don't screw it up, Rick. Ah, you screwed it up, Rick. Ah. Oh well, we'll get it this time. <laughs> oh, absolutely, George. Um. Hang on, was it that? No, was that the one you played? Headlocked. I'm getting confused. No, you played mythologies. No, we are. We haven't played Shaolin much yet. Headlock, do you have that in your repertoire? I'm just curious. I don't, I've never played that game. I don't even know if it's any fun or not, to be honest. Oh, we got him this time. Jeez. It's a headache. And guys, welcome back once again to One Coin Only for the uh, bonus stream if you just joined us. Really appreciate your company multiple times this evening. It means a world to us. We hope you're having a great night. And uh, we're just doing some Mega Man 2 d -Mate today. We should hammer through this pretty quickly, hopefully. It's pretty similar to the NES version, just a tiny bit different to fit in with the sort of Atari style, I guess you could say. Um, we are going to do... Bubble Man and Air Man. Yes, that's that's the order we're going in. All right. How you doing, Jeremy? Welcome back, my friend. It's always good to see you. And uh, yeah, well, we'll it's a choice. We can play Shaolin Monks or Badass Babes. What do you reckon? I think Shaolin Monks is better. <laughs> That's going to start a fight. Okay, so there you go, you heard it. Jeremy prefers Shaolin Monks. Done. <laughs> oh my gosh. Makes me wonder what other naughty hidden gems there are on Steam at the moment. I'm such a bad man. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> That, that, I was so embarrassed. I, I, oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, no, there's an option with this. You've got a choice between the Atari music and uh, uh, the remake music. Uh, the reason I haven't chosen the Atari music for this one is uh, because it does get on your nerves, and I just wanted to make the listening experience a bit more pleasant for you guys. So this is actually a PC remake that's uh, emulated the game into Atari graphics. So I don't want to confuse anyone. This is, you can anyone can download this and play this on PC. Oh, you know what? That, that could be true, man. Please do and let me know, hey? But, but you would think that one would be worse than the commercial version, wouldn't you? I don't know. You never know. Haiti, yeah, Haiti, okay. You'd have to look at that one. Ah, <laughs> jeez. Oh, oh, crap. Ah! Oh! 
I've got to concentrate a bit more here. Alright, we'll get this. It's okay, guys. We're okay. Clumsy ass, some bitch. <laughs> I keep forgetting about the jumping in the water. Alright. Oh, that was close. Far out. That would have made me absolutely rage if I fell on that. It's alright, we got this. How you doing, Brentley? It's really good to see you, my man. Thanks for joining the stream. And, uh, how you going today, sir? What's happening? Thanks for coming along. Just playing uh, the Atari D-Make of Mega Man 2, my friend. Just a little bit of a gimmick game to finish things off. This will probably literally be the last time I ever play this, which is why I'm streaming it today on YouTube. Oh, actually, I'll lie. I'll probably do this one more time on Facebook, but not for a very long time. But, uh... Yeah. You can't beat the original, but this is just nice for shits and giggles, I think. If, if that's a term you understand in the United States. Sunfish Army. Yeah, man, keep those hashtags coming. We've got a message to spread... We've got a message to spread to the whole world, basically. We're gonna, we're gonna let everyone know what we're all about. Ah, crap. Alright, so, we should be able to beat his ass pretty, pretty badly with this metal blade, hopefully. Let's see how we go. Oh, there we go. Yeah, that's good. This is gonna be an easy victory. No complaints here. We just popped your bubble, sir. Take that. That's a pretty good one-liner, right? I think it was. Maybe my dad could come up with something better. <laughs> oh, jeez. Alright, we're gonna do Airman, then we're gonna do Heatman. Boom. I got my order down. I don't know if you get your full lives back at the end of the level. I'm just going to check. Oh, no, you do. Okay, that's a pretty good thing, actually. I like that they've... Oh, okay, I've forgotten about this thing. Alright. Just wait for this sucker to... Alright, we're good. Boom. I absolutely love the music in this level too. Uh, you know what, you can't beat the music on Mega Man 2. Mega Man 3 is close, uh, but you can't beat it on the whole from Mega Man 2. It's just so good. You know, I really enjoyed Mega Man uh, 10. I played that recently, speaking of Mega Man games, and the only thing that spoiled that one for me was the fact that the music just wasn't the same as the older ones. Oh, you're gonna shoot and push it across. Okay, the system in this one's a bit different. It's all good. Okay. We got you, sir. Ah, uh, nah, that'd be okay. Oh, uh, Nintendo music was freaking amazing. And you know what, um, Sega Master System, uh, you guys in North America don't know much about Sega Master System, but that system had amazing graphics, but the music just, in most games, wasn't very pleasant, and, uh, you know, I think the sound is very important in games, and NES just had that on lock. Oh, son of a... Bit, no, don't you dare fall down, Mega Man. Don't you even think about it. Alright, we got this. Uh, trying to be patient here. Saw something about Australian fighting parents twice a month for not vaccinating their kids, good or bad. Um, well, I think that's good. It's different over here. I don't know how your health system works, but Australians actually get free health care, Jeremy. So, uh, it, it's pretty much all free over here. That's one thing that we're really fortunate to have. So, in Australia, there's kind of no excuse uh, to not vaccinate your kids if, um, if it's not costing the parents anything to get it done, you know what I mean? 
Like, it'd be a different issue if, like, they weren't getting the support because they were poor, but... I think you know where I'm going. Yeah, it's, it's all circumstance, really. But, uh, yeah, I'm not one that likes to go into politics or anything, but it just seems common sense. If it's free, you should get it. the jump. There we go, we got it. Those things are just like sketching me out. <laughs> oh, you've been listening to the Shovel Knight soundtrack for days. Yeah, that chiptune kind of soundtrack in like modern Steam games is some of my favourite. Like, that's just on point, isn't it? It's is really, really good. I, th I think Canada is pretty similar, but don't hold me to that. You'll have to ask Sylvain that question, actually. I totally get it, you know, like the... It, it's a different system over here, so it's all circumstantial. Now we've got the jet, so that's going to make the Hitman level pretty easily, hopefully. And welcome to everyone who's joining us. Welcome once again to One Coin. Good to finally have you here. And uh, I'm glad you finally made it to the party. As I always say, better late than never. So you know, the early bird might take the worm, but the late snake gets a cake. So welcome along. Now I don't know what the hell that means, but it sounded good when I thought about it. <laughs> Okay, back to bed. Yeah, absolutely. Why not? <laughs> How you doing, Anarchy? It's Nino. It's really good to have you here. We are playing a fan-made version of Mega Man 2, and this is the Atari d -Mate. This is kind of a gimmick version of Mega Man 2, and uh, it is pretty sweet. I just thought I'd show you what this game looks like and how it plays today. And I hope you're absolutely well, my friend. It's always good to see you. That's why you need the metal blades for this, this section, I keep forgetting. Either keep forgetting or I just get lazy. You pick. Oh, platforming here, seriously. Alright, I'm done with it. Can we move? We can't move on yet. I can't, I, oh, get out of it. I, I can't handle the stress of this section. Ah, get away! Jerk. <laughs> Please tell me there's a health drop here somewhere. Oh boy. I've gone back to the comments. Oh shit! Oh man, that doesn't sound good. Yeah, I'm keen to hear the rest of that story. Jeez. That, that really makes me freaking sad, bro. That really makes me freaking sad. I'm... S oh my gosh. I'm so sorry that the, the healthcare system is that rough where you guys are. Yeah, man, I don't know what to say. I feel really horrible for you guys. Oh, Jeremy, absolutely, man. I play all of them. Well, I don't do the Mega Man X series. That's one series I'm not very strong at. But I play Mega Man 1 to 6. And uh, I also play Mega Man 10. So, I play a handful of games. I want to try 7 and 8 in the near future as well. And also play the arcade versions. If you've heard of them. The power battles. Let me keep going here. How you doing, Hardy boys? It's really good to see you, my man. Thanks for joining the stream. I hope you're fantastic. There we go. We got that sun bish. This section is always really tricky. This, is, this section is pretty much the same as uh, in the main game. Oh no! Fucking asshole! <laughs> I left it too late. 
Okay, there must be a way I can... I think there's a trick around it. Excuse my language. <laughs> what a jerk! What a freaking jerk! I hate you, game. You're stupid. <laughs> ah, get out of it! Alright, we're good. Alright, I'm gonna stay calm. I don't wanna start dropping F-bombs here. That was that was pretty stupid though, guys. You have to admit. That oh, I should've stayed... Ah, oh, no! I should've stayed up there. Okay, keep calm. Oh, we just made it. Far out. I don't want to do that ever again. That sucks. Holy shit. Okay. Okay, so I can do my little flying thing here now. <laughs> this is killing me. Uh, three to six. And I, yeah, man, absolutely. I've been playing a lot of Mega Man... Uh, this year, so I'm trying not to do too much. I mean, there's no such thing as too much Mega Man, technically, but um, I'll, I'll mix things up a bit before I do more Mega Man games, but they're coming, Jeremy, so don't worry. They're 100% coming. Oh, gosh. Okay. I had, a, I had like, an aneurysm during... <laughs> Seriously, that was terrible! That was really stressing me out. Okay, um, we've... We're gonna use a bubble for this guy, I think. Okay. Pretty, pretty easy stuff for this guy. No, no sweat. Take that heat, man. Let's see what goodies he gets equipped with now. Boom gonna be burning down the house. It's true. Alright, we do Clash Man this time. Oh, lots to do. I'm kind of overwhelmed, actually, because I have such such a big library. That can be really bad, because, uh, it's, you know, as I always say, like, streaming's the same as my DJ, and every time you get new games, it pushes old ones, like, out of your head. Like, it's really hard to, like, remember and... A, a large pile of games. I don't know if that makes sense or not, but yeah. Having having a big library ready is sometimes detrimental. <laughs> Likewise, Steve. Thanks for coming in, man. How are you going? Hope you're well. Thanks for joining the stream, sir. I'm just going to have a little bit of fun here with the last stream of the day. I love the music in this level. It, it's, it's, it's on point, isn't it? Really good. As you can see, this little section here is a little bit different. There we go. Is that health or is that magic? No, it is health. You can't always tell. Oh no, that was ma- I'm confused. That was actually magic, I think. There we go. This is all timing. Yeah, I try to I try to write a cheat sheet of games that I want to stream, otherwise I forget everything that I've got, you know what I mean? Yeah, like the, my 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 Steam library, Jeremy, like you can just go and see the size of my Steam library for yourself. It's it's absolutely ridiculous. And I still struggle to pick. <laughs> have to use an energy tank here. Uh, I, I don't know why I'm struggling with this thing. He takes a lot of freaking shots. He's annoying. It's really... I have to... Oh, that was close, wasn't it? Please don't tell me I have to take on another one. Yeah, that's alright. Oh my gosh. farm here for a sec, because I'm hoping they'll drop some health, maybe not, come on, drop some health, they're dropping magic and they're not dropping health, there we go, there's a little bit of health, that'll do, a little teacup will do, better than nothing, 
Just no Fortnite. Nah, man, I'm not going to do Fortnite. And it's not even that I hate the game Fortnite. Fortnite's actually a really good game. It's just everyone streaming it. It's just uninspired, you know? Oh, I, um... There's no point in me streaming Fortnite if every mate in this dog is already streaming it. So don't worry, that's not going to happen. You can never have too many games. I'm learning that very quickly. <laughs> oh, crap. Hopefully we get out of here. Oh, there's another energy tank there. That's alright, we'll leave it go for now. I think there's a... Crap! Keep forgetting about this section. There we go, another health. We need that. Alright. What are you doing, Mega Man? You're being an asshole. <laughs> ah. Yeah, that's all it is. It's just one of those things. Uh, see, I, I don't think... I, don't, I, I I wouldn't go that far. I just, As I said, I just think it's saturated. It's just too much at the moment. I, I don't hate on it or anything. Oh, man. Just get out of the... I think we're almost done here. Alright, cool. Pull out the air thing. Again. Oh well. <laughs> yeah. Do you guys play any of that battle battle royal stuff, or are you just not interested in general? I'm just curious. A lot of people play PUBG as well. I've never. I've, I mean, I played a little Fortnite. When I say a little Fortnite, I literally mean a little Fortnite. Maybe a couple of hours in total. I've never ever played PUBG. Yeah, yeah, you'll do it. Don't worry, Jeremy. You, you don't have to ask him twice to play a Mortal Kombat game. <laughs> uh, I, always, I always do uh, Quick Man Last. I don't know what order you guys do it in, but I always do Quick Man Last. I hate that level too. Not interested? Yeah, fair enough. That's fair call really, isn't it? Just beat Far Cry 5. Uh, how did you enjoy it? I haven't played Far Cry 5 yet. I really want to play Far Cry Primal again. I love the survival type of games. Far Cry Primal is actually a lot of fun. Uh, but I think Far Cry 3 is still uh, my favourite out of all the ones that I've played. I like the music in this level too. I just completely went the wrong way because I'm an asshole. <laughs> What are you doing, Rick? It'd be nice if you... I have to go all the way back. Oh, wait, no, I've got flash bombs. What the frig am I doing? Derp. There we go, we got this. Nothing we can't handle, guys. My apologies. Yeah, that's it. Num number three? Yo, you don't... You don't, oh yeah, number three is, I wasn't sure what you were saying for a second. I thought the soundtrack in particular for number three was phenomenal. It really made the game. I loved, I loved, um, absolutely loved when you did that marijuana mission in Far Cry 3. You had that Skrillex and Bob Marley remix playing, and I was like, man, this is freaking awesome. Like, that, that would have had to have been the soundtrack of all soundtracks for that level. <laughs> Oh, good memories, man. I had so much fun playing that. Is this a ROM D-hack? Oh, this is a standalone game headlock. This this is one of the ones that I got off Game Jolt. So, uh, you can... Anyone can install this on their PC. Um, it's just made in, uh... You know, the inspiration was just Atari 2600 for this. Damn, I forgot another e -tank. Stupid one. Alright, I think I can get plenty more as I go along. Blood Dragon, I've never played Blood... I got Blood Dragon, but I never ended up playing it, hey. I know that came bundled with Far Cry 3. But yeah, I never ended up doing it. I still have it, I still have it. I could always go back to it anytime. 
I didn't realize it was it was that awesome. Uh, oh, is that all? It's just a warp. Whatever. <laughs> okay. I'm sure we can get some help in a sec. That'll be absolutely freaking handy, hopefully. Just jump on our little jetpack here and go, hey, what's up? Hey, what's up? There we go. We got it. And uh, we'll go back down here. We got this, guys. Shoot that little mofo. Alright. If I love ter like Terminator, I like Blood Dra Really? Alright, now I'm extra intrigued. You're gonna have to give me a quick rundown of what the story is about, bro. There we go, we're out of here. I don't know, Danielle, that's really strange. Um, guys, uh, if you've subscribed to us already, it might be a good idea to unsubscribe and resubscribe again and also click the bell. If you do that, I think it resets the system and you will get all my notifications. Uh, YouTube has changed the algorithm, not everyone's getting notifications, it's really frustrating. Um, it's a problem I'm aware of and unfortunately can't do anything about. So, middle finger in the air to you, YouTube. <laughs> ah! Alright, we're gonna try this again. Yeah, no, I, th I think it's more than just clicking the bell. Oh, gosh. Oh, come on. There we go. Did, I don't know how I just got him, but... Who am I to argue? <laughs> yeah, no, that's alright. Cool. Yeah, I would suggest unsubscribing, resubscribing, and click the bell, and you should get all the notifications again. I think, I think the new algorithm prioritizes newer subscribers. It's really strange. I don't know why, but a lot of the big YouTubers have been saying to do that uh, in their vlogs, I've noticed. And we've got the Awesomeness Destroyer, my friend. How are you going today? Thank you so much for coming in. Welcome once again to One Point Only. It is always good to have you, my brother. We are playing Mega Man 2 D-Mate today. Okay, yeah, cool, man. Thanks, Dan. I appreciate it. Next minute, Danielle unsubscribes and never comes back. <laughs> so, bye, Dan. Nice knowing you. I'm just kidding. Oh, crap. You do, sir. At least it's working for you. Ah, oh, I missed another energy oh, a bitch. I missed another energy tank. I still got two. So, I'm pretty sure I can get another two in the final level, so it's all good. Ah. Oh, that resets when I do that. That's frustrating. Oh well. My brother could at least drop some freaking uh, help for me. Oh my gosh. There we go, we're almost out. Oh my goodness. Okay, this is probably a little bit easier than the NES version, so I'm not complaining. It's very rare that I do that first try, so that's freaking awesome. Oh, now we're, now we're blind. That's lucky. I had to guess where that freaking thing was. Ah. I'm gonna just... Oh, chill here for... Oh, come on. Alright, we're okay. Now, what do we use to defeat Quick Man again? Oh, we're gonna use a flash. I'm probably going to lose a life on purpose so I get full health again, so don't mind me for a second. <laughs> yeah, just let, just, let me, just let me lose my life, and then I'll just reset shit here. Alright, we're cool. So, I can't remember which weapon's a flash. Um, that's a flash there. Okay, we got this. We should be able to do this alright. that to drain everything. And then we're going to use the pea shooter to finish him off. Which hopefully we're successful with. We're about to find out. 
2 3 shoot is pretty effective. That's, that's no problem. Alright, we busted his ass. <laughs> We're all good, guys. We're all good. In the hood. Or something like that. Alright, so we're doing the Wily stages now. Now, we're hammering through this pretty quickly. We should probably be finished in about 20 minutes. So, we'll see how we go. Oh, Sylvain, it's always good to have you, my man. Welcome to the stream, sir. Thanks for coming in. How goes it, my brother? I hope you're well. Yeah, it's really good. Oh, now... Behold the most epic tune in 8-bit history right now. Never get tired of this tune. Ah, oh, crap. Uh, the only thing that they've left out is, um... You know how you get the special items, like the jet and, like, the, the tops and everything? You only get the jet in this. You don't get the other special items, like the, the claw or the top or whatever. So, I mean, it has been condensed a little bit, but not too much. About 95... I'd probably say it's probably more like 90% accurate to the NES version. It's very close. If not, it's only a little less than that. The actor from Terminator who protects Sarah Connor does the voice acting in Blood Rain. Uh, which Terminator? Are you talking about the original Terminator? Or are you talking about um, the re... So you mean Michael Bane does the voice for Blood Dragon? Man, I, I think he's an awesome actor. I, was a, I, I liked him in Terminator. I liked him in Alien. He was a really cool action star. Very underrated. I always really enjoyed what he did. Michael Bane or Michael Vine? I don't know how you pronounce it, but I know who you're talking about. Yeah, yeah, I know, yeah, exactly, I know who you're talking about. Yep. Yeah. How you doing, Lunatic Fringe? Good to see you, my man. Welcome to the stream. <laughs> Michael, but yeah, I don't, I'm not sure how to pronounce it, forgive me. Yeah, he's really cool. Oh, how do I get out of here? Oh, that was close. I wasn't sure I was going to make it. Alright, so we need to get that life. That's, I don't trust myself against this dragon coming up as an asshole. Everyone's an asshole. I mean, I really mean it. Alright, here we go. I should really stop swearing so much, forgive me. Dwayne's a polite streamer. I'm the one that has a potty mouth. I need Dwayne to counterbalance one point only. Ah! <laughs> oh! <laughs> I need to pay more attention. There we go, I'm gonna shoot him on the left. Aw, oh, come on! Let's just not freaking mate. Alright, we got this. <laughs> oh my goodness, getting back to the comments now. Uh, 80s action films, that it was just such a great age for action movies. They were just so bad, they were good. I love them all. <laughs> If you say so, Danielle. Jeez, girl. Oh, thank you, Hardy. Look, man, I'm getting close. I can't quite give up DJing yet. Like, the extra money is going to be really helpful. Because I want to inject as much money as I can into the brand for now. But, um, yeah, literally, it's, uh, the last month has really been a life changer. I can't believe what's happening for one coin at the moment. I feel incredibly blessed, guys, and, uh, honestly, you are the ones that have made it happen for me, so... I'm internally grateful for all your support, thank you so much. Oh, gosh. And this is a tricky sumbish. I'm just getting out of here. Alright, we're okay now, I think. Is this an NES hack with an Atari feel? This is actually a PC, uh, PC game, sir. Oh, I love the running man. That also had... I love the... Uh, Jesse Ventura was awesome too. He was always good with his cameos and stuff. How am I... How am I supposed... Oh, you... Ah, uh, this is a... This is a trap. You're supposed to jet it over. Okay. The game's trying to trick you. Being a jerk. Alright, we got this. We're gonna equip the boomerang for this level, I think. Thanks, Rob. I really appreciate it, man. Like, uh... I just want to keep working hard, keep pushing. I don't want to start getting complacent, you know what I mean? 
just want to keep doing the best I can every day. And uh, if so far you've got me and Dwayne, when I make a little bit more money, I'm going to hire a third person so you'll get at least uh, three people streaming for you a day very soon. So I, I want it so that you've got streams around the clock no matter what time you tune, tune in, that's the goal. I want you to be able to watch something here 24-7. And uh, I'm going to make that happen within a year, guys. Don't you worry about that. I'm so determined. Ah, crap. I need to eat something. Hang on. Alright. Did I say eat something? That was a bit dumb, wasn't it? Up! Oh, come on! Okay, we got him. <laughs> oh, gosh. Hurry out of here. Alright, so... Wily number two. I can't believe how quick we're getting through this game. I thought we'd be here for two hours. We're going to be done in like an hour. Oh well. Short. A quick game's a good game, I guess. Ah, okay. I can't remember what the boss of this level is. Do you get all your specials back? Yeah, you do with this one. In the NES version, you don't. I think we need to use a jetpack here. And I think I can get an energy tank from up here if I'm not mistaken. I'm hoping we can get an energy tank. Yeah, that's what I was hoping for. Great. No sweat, we got this, guys. Now, unlike in the NES version, to move these things, they don't move by themselves. You have to shoot in the opposite direction. And we got that covered. That bit's easy. There we go. Just metal man our way out of this. See what's next. Uh, I think I can metal what man my way out of this again. I better make sure I save that weapon though, because I'm pretty sure I need it for the next boss. A Sonic movie? Oh really? I didn't even realize there was a Mega Man movie coming. If that is true, that is freaking awesome. Ah, oh, there you go. You guys are tripping me out. <laughs> uh, you, can, you can normally grind these things uh, in the NES version, but in this one they're a lot harder to hit, so best just to avoid them, I guess. Alright, we're out of here. We, we got that, no problem. Uh, may as well put that back in the metal. I kind of wasted one of them. Anyway, it's all good. Maybe we can shoot a couple of these. Maybe they'll drop something. Maybe it's both. It could be both. You never know. Maybe there's going to be a Mega Man and a Sonic movie. I doubt it, but that would be pretty awesome. Dr. Eggman. Oh, I get confused. Because, yeah... I don't know why they changed the name of him, but it is what it is. Ah. Sucker. Alright, let's go. I am going to use my jet here because I don't trust my jumping abilities. So, we're going to cheat our way across because that's what one coin only does. Oh, me too. You were so awesome. Uh, ha uh, I don't know how to get a... Oh, crap! That was pretty challenging. My goodness. Okay, that was pretty tricky, but well played one point. You got past that. Just takes a little bit of concentration. Some. Oh, okay, I see what's happening here. You're better off just taking the hit. Uh, we're going to open this up and get that life, because that's what we do. You gonna play Cuphead while you watch Listen? 
Well, hey, that's cool, Danielle. I I'm totally aware that women are better old than at multitasking than what men are, so that's perfectly okay. I admit it. I know it's a fact. Ah! Ah! Oh crap, that was too close. Oh my goodness. Okay, we're out of here. Ah, oh, jeez. Deep breath, Rick. <laughs> Cuphead is awesome. If you haven't played Cuphead before... Oh, I'm gonna take the hit. I'm gonna need full health for this. You won't be disappointed. Cuphead is a great game. And uh, as frustrating as what Cuphead is, it is still incredibly fun. I'm going to do a, a YouTube stream of Cuphead very soon, but I'm waiting for 8-Bit Steve to do it first. He's going to do it on his show. Alright. Crap, I'm not very good at this one. Might have to use a tank. It's going okay. Oh crap, now they're going big quick. Might have to use some uh Might have to use some health soon. Oh crap. Garbage. Alright, yeah, we're gonna have to use that E-Tank. Damn, I've only got one left now, it's not fair. Okay. Alright. We're gonna get maybe one or two in the next level, so it's okay. Alright, done. <sighs> okay, get back to the comments. Oh, so it is a Sonic movie. And Jim Carrey's gonna play Dr. Robotnik, hey? That'll be interesting. I'd love to see how they pull it off. And Kale, how are you going today, my friend? It's always good to have you. Cuphead is ridiculously hard, but you know what? Cuphead is incredibly rewarding when you beat a boss. Seriously, I've never felt so much satisfaction than when I've beaten a boss in Cuphead, let me tell you. Oh gosh. Yeah, I raged like a sunbish in that game, seriously. Alright. There we go, we're gonna use a little E-Tank here. We need that more than anything. Keep going. You wanted a rated R Cuphead game? How's that gonna work? <laughs> Hey, I don't, I don't mind if you guys have me on the background. It's all still incredibly supportive, guys, and I'm appreciative all the same. You're still building up my YouTube watch minutes for me. Okay. We're gonna get through this. This is my least favorite section, I think. I'm just double... No, the next section is my least favorite section. This one is okay. The, the boss in this one's pretty basic. No, we, we got this. We'll be okay. Oh, the art style in Cuphead is, is phenomenal, isn't it? So, we, we have to drop down here or we're going to hit the spikes. There's a few tricks to this. Okay, so we're going to go down here. we to be very careful to avoid everything. It's, you see, a lot of this is still pretty pretty much the same as the NES version. Ah, stupid shooty thing. And got him. Ah! Oh, I wasn't paying attention. I was looking at the comment. I'm going to blame you for that, Headlocked. Ah! Oh, what a jerk. Not you, Headlocked, the game. I wasn't blaming you that time. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I can't believe that happened. Ah! Um, oh. You're always going to keep your eyes open in this fish, seriously. Can you use a jet underwater? We're going to find out. Yeah, I'm going to shortcut my way out of this fish, seriously. See you later. Oh, ah, oh, ah, oh, stay on that, sunbish. Oh, we're good. We're okay now. Yeah, the fish is easy. No problem. Hopefully he drops some health. Oh, speaking of health, we got it. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Okay. 
Oh, yeah, I'd love to see you guys co-op. Speaking of which, we need to co-op too, Dwayne. Very, very soon. We need to work out what we're going to do. Video game logic for the win every time, my friend. Absolutely. <laughs> what, are you, what are you talking about, Danielle? You're beautiful. And you should never ever listen to trolls. Seriously. Trolls only say the things they do because they're broken on the inside. So I, I try to have empathy for trolls because... Um, even though what they do is incredibly cruel and nasty, um, no one that's healthy on the inside goes out of their way to make someone feel bad, you know what I mean? So, don't take it to heart. Trolls really say more about them than what it does about you. Here we go, we got- oh, crap, we got this. There we go, that one's pretty easy. <laughs> yeah, because I always do that. Ah! Oh! It's kind of like my trademark temper tantrum, isn't it? Alright, so this is, this is my least favourite section here now. If we can get past this in one piece, then we should be home sailing. I hope. Is that even a term that make... Does that... It... I don't know. I don't know if I said something that even made sense, but we're going to carry on here. Oh, honey, I'm, I'm really sorry to hear. That makes me feel really sad, hey? That sucks. People are shit. <laughs> we all love you here. Oh yeah, I found this on the web. You can get this and other games like this at a website called GameJolt.com, Sylvain. Um, i sort of known about the site a little bit, but then uh, Headlock Gaming here told me to give it a bit, bit of a deeper look. And so I have, and I've got a lot of good games from there. But you have to dig around a little bit because they can be hit and miss. Okay, cool. We got three out of the four. Um, okay. I'm trying to focus here for a little second. I think we're okay. We don't really need the extra lives. We're just gonna run it. Oh crap! Really? Ah! Ah! Oh, stop it! Ah! Oh, stop being a dick! Oh no! Oh my gosh! We're gonna, we really need that, okay. We're gonna buy some time. How, how the hell are we supposed to get past that? How, how are we supposed to get past that? Oh, come on! How am I supposed to get past that? I don't get it. Oh, someone's gonna have to tell me what the secret is for that. I don't understand the puzzle. Oh, no! Oh, you're gonna use Flashman. I see. No, I know what to do. Forget I said anything. I get it. It's a it's a slightly cryptic secret which I understand. I actually I actually get it. Okay, we're good. Ah, oh. ah! Oh! oh no! I know you're not, girl. We we we're just your friends, and we wanna we wanna raise your spirit, you know. get it this time. Stupid. Okay, now we can keep going. <laughs> we'll get it. I'm just going to be a bit more careful this time around. This level is actually more tricky in this version than I think it is in the original. Alright, just going to take the one hit. Let's go down. Okay, we got it. Oh, 
Alright, there we go. So we need to have Flashman equipped. And we need to go bang. Just like that. Happy days, kiss my ass, I solved the puzzle. Alright, let's go. <laughs> Man, I better bubble this again because I don't trust it. Okay, no, we're okay. Oh my goodness, I'm going to have a heart attack at this rate. Uh, well, we may as well just put it back in there. Flash stop. Yeah, yeah, George, I just saw it. Thank you, man. Did it remind you of a game on Wonder Swan? I don't think I know of any Wonder Swan games, actually. What is a Wonder Swan? It's kind of thrown me. Ah. Oh. <laughs> yeah. I, I really need to grow up. I'm a little bit immature, aren't I, Daniel? <laughs> I've got a, I, I've got such a way with words. Ah, oh, no, I forgot about that asshole. It's all right, we got. Ah, oh, no, we have to do it again. <sighs> Let's go. That's all right. It's easy enough. Oh, come on. <laughs> this level is so different to the NES original. Now oh, drop a health. Oh, he's not... You have to keep... Okay. No, the secret is to do this. We need to use the... There you go. Easy done. Oh, I see. I think I remember what that is now, actually. I mean, I do remember a, bla a black and white handheld console from my youth. I, uh... It, I've, I've seen it maybe once or twice in the department store. I just didn't realize that's what it was called. Interesting. <laughs> Thanks, Jeremy. Oh, that's a, that's a nice analogy. That's pretty kind, actually. Thank you, Rob. And as long as you guys are entertained, I'm not bothered. We have to go through here. Ha <laughs> ha! We got you! Some bitch. You didn't subscribe for adulting. I'll keep that in mind. So, we are going to have to use our flash weapon in here and probably... Alright, we got this. This level has always been incredibly hard. But it looks like it's going to be a lot easier in this version, so that's okay. Maybe we only need to... Oh crap. There we go. This is a lot easier than in the original, that's for sure. So we're going to shoot that. There we go. I think that's the first time I've ever done that section without an E-Tank, so we're set. I, yeah, I just, uh... I like, to, I like to push the boundaries a little bit without going over the line. You know, I just don't want to be a stiff. And Danielle, no stiff jokes. See what I mean? That kind of humour. <laughs> Very, very, very juvenile, but that's just me. I'm a big 37-year-old child. Okay, we're doing all the robot bosses now. Hell yeah. And, uh, three out of four. So, who's this? This is... Uh, who do we use? Ah, uh, we're gonna use the Clash Bombs against this one. No problem. Boom. So, the next one... Yeah, of course, Hardy Boys. Absolutely, man. So, metal on metal, that usually works in the original. There we go, done. Uh-oh, yeah. <laughs> Pretty much, eh? Ah, <laughs> uh, so, we have to use air against this guy, I think. Ah, uh, hard to catch him. He's like trying to catch a fly in chopsticks. There we go, we got him. Done. <laughs> oh, I love you guys, you're awesome. Uh, we're going to use the flash for this. Done. Hey! That's too, that's too naughty, Rob. 
<laughs> ah, fair, fair call. Fair call, Jeremy. Alright, done. Got this one. Uh, you know what? Uh, overall, Sylvain, it's maybe a tiny bit easier. Some parts are a little bit more difficult, and some parts are a little bit easier. Um, I would like to think I'm just making the game look easier than it is, because I've had lots of practice. That would be pretty awesome, but... Yeah, to be honest, it is a little bit easier, I'm not gonna lie. It's kind of a walk in the park today, isn't it? Damn, that, that, that's... That's in a really tricky spot. That was in a really tricky spot for us, jeez. Oh, gosh. <laughs> awesome, uh, good, Dwayne. I'm glad we're on the same page. That's why we probably have such good chemistry. Uh, so we're going to charge up the heat bomb here, I think. Boom. Take that, you sumbish. Uh, we'll just finish him off with a metal blade, whatever. Bye. There we go. Again, so it's alright. So it's in here. Heat man, throw a couple bubbles, all good. Ah, oh, damn, a little bit clumsy there. Alright, we got this. And what's in this one? Oh, that's right, we get to refill everything. Fan freaking taxi. Uh, we don't really need any of that stuff, but we'll humor ourselves just in case. Uh, we need the metal blade pretty much for this whole thing, don't we? Oh, well, we're going to find out. <laughs> awesome. Actually, that's... Maybe it's flash bombs on it. Ah, there we go. I'm trying to I'm trying to remember what weapon this ah, crap. No, what weapon is maybe it's a little bit different, I don't know. No, it's not that one. Ah Okay, we're gonna keep using heat here. Actually I think it's just a pea shooter for this one to be honest. We'll use, we'll use the metal blade for the next form. Ah, uh, this is really easy. This is highly patternized. So we're just going to use another tank here. We'll pull out the metal blade this time. Okay. Oh, we're going we're we're to beat the living piss out of this guy. There we go. Shooty shooty and all that. It won't be one second, guys. Not ignoring anyone. There we go. Take that. Oh, you know what? I can't really have an honest opinion, George, because I've never ever played the Mega Man X games properly, to be honest. Um, because when Super Nintendo was popular, I had a Sega Genesis, so I wasn't really playing uh, the Mega Man X games. Um, so it's not really fair of me to judge. Maybe ask everyone else in the room. That'd be a big, uh, that'd be a really good debate, actually. <laughs> oh, I feel your pain on that one. I need to catch up on my domestics too, Danielle. Seriously? Heaven forbid if I have enough money, I'm gonna get, like, a, a, a housekeeper once a fortnight just so I can concentrate on my work. Because seriously... Uh, ha oh, man, housework just distracts you from the things that you want to, like, do work-wise. And I hate it. And I'm lazy. I'll admit it. I'm totally lazy. <laughs> I probably won't get a housekeeper. That's a dream. I was just saying. I'm 
I'm alright with some things, like I clean my bathroom, I do my washing and all that. The one thing I don't do is cook. I, I hate cooking for myself. Even though I used to be a small business cook, or a small kitchen cook, um, I hate cooking for myself at home. It just takes up time that I don't want to give towards cooking, you know what I mean? Probably not. Really. <laughs> we are almost out of here. Thank you so much for joining us for this stream today, guys. This is the conclusion right now. Oh, I see. That's why I like to live in a unit and a townhouse, Jeremy, because I freaking hate the yard. I had a really, really big backyard where I used to live, and man, that was absolute hell. Never again. Because you expected to weed, I had to constantly, like, I had a lot of palm trees where I lived, so I had to, like, constantly clean up the ferns and get, like, a, a dump truck around, and, man, the amount it cost to maintain my last backyard, never freaking again, seriously. It's just a freaking nightmare. And, uh, we almost got this sunbish already. This is really, really quick. This is a very anticlimactic final boss battle, but we've done it, guys. One lazy only, yeah. <laughs> love cooking, love yard work. Well, power to you, Rob. Come over and do mine. I'll pay you. <laughs> I'm just playing, man. <sighs> this is awesome. Well, we're going to play out the credits, and then we're going to bail. I didn't realize this stream was going to be so quick. But uh, I guess this version of Mega Man 2 is a little bit easier. But all the same, thank you so much for joining us, guys, for the late night stream. Uh, I understand, Daniel. Yeah, no, I get it. Totally. Totally understand. Since I'm stunned pretty early, I might actually go up. I might have a shower and then go up the road and get a haircut. Yeah, I understand. Might even get something to eat. I'm pretty hungry. How you doing, Gareth? Thanks for... Better late than never, man. Thank you so much for joining us, Gareth. I appreciate your visit today. And, uh, thank you, Dwayne. Always appreciate you, sir. Yeah, that's it. Keep those hashtags coming. Zambish. Yes, sir. And as I said, we're just going to play out the, the credits quickly because we are saving this video permanently to YouTube. I guess we'll call it a day. Uh, when you guys wake up in the morning, we've got Headlock Gaming back uh, doing part two of uh, Mortal Kombat uh, Complete Edition Story. And then I'll be on doing something at some point. Oh, yeah. I'm going to be streaming. Uh, what am I streaming tomorrow? I'm streaming House of the Dead Overkill. There you go. So I've got a nice uh, zombie late night stream for you guys. It's going to be awesome. Thank you, Jeremy. I'm, I'm glad you think so. <laughs> Zombish. Yes, sir. Absolutely, my man. And uh, the, the, the people... Actually, I'll tell you a really cool story. Um... The, the people at Facebook spoke to uh, Babom from Xbit Gaming, who's the owner, and apparently that Sumbish hashtag is trending big time. Apparently Facebook says it's becoming a big deal. So we need to keep those coming, guys. That's that's going to be freaking awesome. Ah, uh, no, that's okay. Um, I'm going to give you guys a pointer one more time. If you're not getting the notification, try unsubscribing and then resubscribing and click the bell. Uh, apparently that resets the YouTube system, and then you will probably get every notification again. Um, it's really weird. Like, uh, are you guys getting the notifications when, when Headlock comes on? I don't know. I don't know why YouTube's picking on me for. <laughs> oh, Sylvain, it's always a pleasure, my man. I'm glad you enjoyed. Oh, yeah, it's just one of those things. I wonder how long these credits are. I guess a lot of, I guess you gotta give credit to all the people that made the game. That's why I play them out. You know, they gotta take the credit. I played their game on live video and streamed it, so you gotta give everyone their due. But uh you guys have all been amazing. Thank you so much for coming in. We're gonna call that a wrap now. Uh, just a reminder, guys. Of uh, the one coin only shop if you want to grab yourself a hoodie or a tee every little bit helps and uh, most importantly We hope you enjoy the clothing 
Thanks, everyone, for being so freaking awesome. We're going to see you again tomorrow for another big day. Take care of yourselves, guys, and good night.